So here's a challenge for you. If uh, you think you have a strong core, um, as you're watching this video, try to do a plank for as long as this guy's doing it. Move, damn you! Okay, so about that five minute plank, which uh, I started working on because I read the George Hood story about how a couple years ago he set the world record at 80 minutes, which is crazy. Um, so I started on January 28th, and I thought five minutes would be pretty good for your average human being. Um, on the 28th, I timed myself at two and a half minutes, not terribly shabby, and I just did a plank every day, timing myself and trying to add like at least five seconds. And I was only able to do that up to a point before I felt like I needed to do it every other day. Like I reached like the four minute mark and then I did every other. And it was weirdly inconsistent about the times I was getting. Like I even did it before I did any heavy lifting. Sometimes I tried doing it afterward, but in any case, the times were never the same every single day. Like they'd fluctuate pretty wildly, which is weird because on some days I'd feel really well rested and then I'd have a particularly poor time for whatever reason. So I finally hit the five minute mark on March 23rd, so it took me 55 days to uh, double my original plank time. And I couldn't really draw that many conclusions from it other than that, well, besides, I don't do a lot of isometric training. Like strength training, it's something that needs to be maintained, of course, and it is not at all consistent, which is was news to me. The only thing that reaching five minutes really did for me was bring up my minimum time to three minutes. Like I can hit three minutes now, no problem whatsoever, but hitting five, it's like, if I'm not feeling really good within that first like minute and a half, I know I'm not gonna get over three minutes. It's strange. So why do planks? Well, planks are really easy to do, don't require a lot of space, and they are one of the best core strengthening exercises there is. If you Google for ab exercises, planks will always show up. I mean, the three things that always show up basically are planks and variations of. Uh, then it's usually like uh, crunches on Swiss balls or um, hanging leg raises. But yeah, planks, planks are always in there somewhere on all those top five and top ten lists throughout the internet. So another funny story, as I'm doing this, uh, Davis, who's who I've pointed out on the show before, he decided to go ahead and try hitting five minutes as well, and he ended up surpassing me. This is Davis. He ended up surpassing me, like, hitting five and a half minutes two weeks before I even got to five minutes. And we had some theories about that. We thought that maybe it was because I weighed 20 pounds more than him, or... It was funny because, you know, the, the long plank time didn't seem to really correlate with all the other... with the different things that he and I were good at. So he's probably past six minutes by this point. Anyway, as far as training planks go, uh, I would recommend if you're trying to hit a certain time, like having a having a two to three minute plank is pretty good. It's pretty good for anybody, really. I'd say it's best to find a song or something that's as long as you want your plank to be and trying to hold out uh, as long as you can to that length of time because just planking there in complete silence or just staring at a stopwatch, that is incredibly boring and dull and really excruciating. The time will pass better if you have at least something to help preoccupy your mind. Oh yeah, and to come back to George Hood, I just checked and found out that he hit a new world record on the plank for three hours and seven minutes and 15 seconds on April 20th of this year. I don't understand that man or how that's even possible. I don't know, my brain would probably implode if I tried to rationalize how he's able to do it for that long. Oh yeah, the audio in like the last minute or so I decided to just cut it out because he, he was doing a lot of very attractive grunting and gasping at this point. I, I thought I'd go ahead and not, not put that in.
Ah, finally, Jesus. Five minutes and a half. Nice. That's a good record. 